Hello there guys, how is it going, Ricardo again? Today I just got a call from a friend of mine who seems to be almost desperate with his uh, music and the way things are moving. For so many years he's, gi I mean, he's been giving his best to, to, to produce great music and put it out there and so on. And uh, probably due to financial factors, he is a little bit uh, kept from moving on. And for all of you there who know a little bit about the music market nowadays, it seems to be a little heartbreaking. Anyways, so I decided to make this message for you guys, all of my musician friends especially of unpopular sounds, which are unlikely to be played on the radio. First of all, if you believe in what you do, and do it freely, giving your best to perfect the style, however strange it may sound, number one thing, my congratulations to you. Sincerely. Because I know how hard it is. Uh, there is something called mainstream which perhaps for national security and preservation of the common banal mentality filters and seals anything that is reflective, questioning, or canning. Note that every time a new style appears, thousands of other similar sounds with ridiculous lyrics are presented to the general public, as the original one is usually boycotted. Usually good stuff from the ghetto. English music is only allowed by the fact that most people don't understand the lyrics in the first place, especially here in Brazil. But anyways, music is an art and a form of art that people consume consciously. But out of laziness, they usually tend to end up listening only to what is played on prostituted radios. There are so many radio stations that do not deserve much uh, prestige, I might say. When you are a musician thinking about giving up, I mean, if you are a musician thinking about giving up, you know, you from the underground, uh, with very little space. The only thing I can say, brother, is don't give up. Don't give up making up your noise, your sound, you know, reinventing, breathing, because we know that this is something that feeds you too. You know, you kind of, a kind of a, a soul that also depends on these vibrations, especially when it comes to live music. You know the power of live music, you know? I know you feel the power of live music, right here. And as for the listeners, on the other hand, who got used to commercial garbage, it's their problem. It's their problem. Forget about it. You know, they must also do their research in order to leave this disgraceful mental cage that not only Brazil but the whole world is at least in terms of music and I say this because once again I really believe that music is food for the soul, food for thoughts, food for attitudes and it is something that people uh, take for granted, you know, I think they really do take for granted. So this is my message for all of the artists of, the artists, artists that actually matter, the ones who are not sold and the ones who are doing uh, independently and trying to, to be sincere and speak the truth, all right? So... That's my message for you. And uh, I'd like to play just a, a quick, quick uh, 
beginning of a song. This is for my friend in particular. And that's one, I think, let me see if I remember this one. Yeah, that's for only for today for you. So, hey Joe, where are you going with that gun in your hand? Why are you going with that gun in your hand? Take it easy, my brother. Take it easy. Don't you worry about a thing. Every little thing is gonna be alright. Peace out.